Welcome to Your Voice. I'm Julia Lokendi. Find out how your budget concerns are being heard in the New York State Senate. Today I'm with Senator John Bonasek, who is your voice in the New York State Senate. How are you, Senator? Good. Good morning, Julia. How are you today? Good. You know, you came in last week after staying up all night negoti negotiating a bunch of major bills. Um, that information is on your website. Um, but the Senate and Assembly right now are in the middle of their one house proposals. They've made their proposals um, to come up with a budget uh, for both houses to agree upon. Um, I want to go first to a clip because you said during the economic development um, negotiations, I want to show what you said there. Okay. Thank you, uh, Chairman Lisi. We've been going through a tough time these past four years, as well as the country, with a really a deep recession. Things are looking a little brighter uh, today than they were last year at this time. And I have three goals that uh, I'm striving for, and it's jobs, it's jobs, and it's jobs. And it's private sector empowerment to create those jobs by less taxes, less regulation on our small businesses, and tax credits to spur job creation. So that is our mission. It'll manifest itself in many different forms and programs, but that's how we have to get New York back by private sector empowerment. Tell us some of the details of these initiatives. Well, some of the things we have is <clears throat> we have uh, in the Senate tax credit proposals. So if you hire someone that's unemployed from the state of New York, that employer will get a tax credit anywhere from around three grand. If you hire somebody, um, well, let me go back a minute, outside the state and you bring them in, it's about three grand. You hire somebody in the state that's unemployed, it can go as much as 5,000 tax credit. And when I use the word tax credit, for those that don't know, it's basically giving an employer cash of 3,000 or 5,000 uh, when they hire that particular employee. Uh, we believe in the Senate that uh, we have to have less regulation less mandates on business, give them more flexibility, more freedom uh, to do what they do best, and that is create jobs and bring economic vitality, not only to their particular business, but to the community in which they're located. So uh, we feel good about that. Uh, we like what Governor Cuomo is doing. And right now, we have three-way negotiations uh, trying to get our tax credit plan in the budget uh, for our small businesses. Great. And also part of that plan is uh, help for people to go to college and they will be eventually entering the workforce. Well, <clears throat> we are always trying uh, to boost uh, aid to education, both uh, from K through 12 and for higher education. So, and then we have another plan uh, where New York works. It's basically an infrastructure plan. Uh, there's a, roughly 15 billion allocated to that and we've been holding that money till the projects are identified uh, by the Department of Transportation and the governor, which we expect very shortly. So we get our, our uh, construction work is out there with the beautiful weather. It's almost 78 degrees today and get them working uh, on all levels. So uh, this is the plan. Push the money out, get it to the small businesses, and let them go run with it. 